I'm Shakura Minna. I'm the Member of Parliament for Streatham, the area I'm from and grew up in. As you've heard from all of the contributions, the values which have driven our decision today are shaped by who we are, uh, where we are from, our experiences. I'm of mixed heritage. Uh, you might not be able to tell, I'm a quarter English, a quarter Irish and half Nigerian. Uh, my forebears came to this country driven by the hope and optimism that if you put the effort in, you can get on and lead a good life in Britain. My father arrived from Nigeria with no money and he worked his way up to become a successful entrepreneur. In spite of the prejudice he experienced, the platform this country gave him to succeed was Britain at its very best. But we've had our ups and our downs. He, the only breadwinner in the family, was killed in a car crash when I was just 13. His death taught me that regardless of your circumstances, people need one another. We want our families to get on in the good times, but my gosh, we need to support each other through the bad times. Too many in Britain face barriers in fulfilling their dreams, their potential, and people don't get the support that they need. We believe it doesn't have to be that way. Fundamental change is needed. Now, the last few years have shown the established parties are simply not up to this challenge. They can't be the change because they have become the problem. They have failed to provide the leadership and clear direction which the UK desperately needs. They are deeply divided. They have failed to fulfil their duties with the competence the public rightly deserves. They've put their party political interest before the national interest, and they don't represent the complex tapestry which is modern Britain. Now, there are those who will say there is no alternative. We are doomed to be saddled with the same old politics that we have to settle for voting for the least worst option or, you know, simply to keep the other lot out, stop them from getting in, that no matter how incompetent they are, we have no option but to vote for these people. We reject this completely. When our democracy is failing, the British people have overcome the hurdles over history to build a better future. We demanded elected MPs take precedence over unelected lords. We insisted working men and women have the vote. We said our parliament should better reflect and look like the country in terms of gender and ethnicity, and now we have got to change our politics again. It is time we dumped this country's old-fashioned politics and created an alternative that does justice to who we are today and gives this country a politics fit for the here and now, the 21st century, not the last one. So we've taken the first step in leaving the old tribal politics behind and we, are, and we invite others who share our political values to do so too. You might come from a Labour background, but you might come from other political traditions. And yes, it's a difficult decision. Make no mistake about that. But think about it. You don't join a political party to spend years and years fighting the people within it. You get involved in politics. You join a party to change the world. So we invite you to leave your parties and help us forge a new consensus on a way forward for Britain. We will sit together as an independent group of MPs in the House of Commons from here on. We haven't yet assigned roles or responsibilities between us, but we will have our first formal meeting as a new group of MPs in the coming days. We want to finish today by speaking directly to the people who send us here, the British people. For far too long, political parties in Westminster, parties of which we've been a part, have been failing you. If you're sick and tired of politics as usual, well, guess what? So are we. That's why we've done what we've done today and why we commit to do things differently. We don't have all the answers, so we'll treat people like adults and be honest about the tough choices facing Britain. We don't have the big money or infrastructure of the political parties. All we can do is direct you to our website. Please sign up and we're asking you to help us shape what the next steps should be. Building a new politics cannot be done in committee rooms in Westminster, so we want to invite you, 
the British people to join us in this en endeavour. If you want an alternative, please help us build it. The bottom line is this. Politics is broken. It doesn't have to be this way. Let's 